Today's lesson, hahanapin natin uli ang greatest common factor o GCF. But this time, ang method na gagamitin ko ay continuous division. Number one, i-rewrite lang natin yung 12 at saka 40. And then, i-divide natin to sa same number na madi-divide sa kanila. So, we have 2. 12 divided by 2 ay 6. 40 divided by 2 ay 20. And 6 at 20 ay divisible pa uli by 2. 6 divided by 2 ay 3. 20 divided by 2 ay 10. Ang 3 at 10 ay hindi na divisible by same number. So, ay stop na tayo. Nasaan si GCF? Eto na yung GCF natin. 2 times 2. And that is equal to 4. Number 2. Nire-write ko na yung 20, 15, and 30. Mag-isip tayo ng number na pwede nating i-divide sa kanilang tatlo. So, we have 5. 20 divided by 5 ay 4. 15 divided by 5 ay 3. 30 divided by 5 ay 6. Ang 4, 3, at 6 ay hindi na divisible by same number except 1. So, ang GCF natin ay eto na. We have 5. I want you to try number 3 and follow me for more quick math lessons.